So Foxy Brown and Redman was at the House of Blues that night when you and Tupac almost got into it. And I noticed, yo, you name dropped Foxy Brown a few times in this interview. I had no idea y'all was that cool, yo. So me and Foxy Brown, we became close with each other, like passing each other. And we became um, intimate friends, right? So in L.A., at the House of Blues, I'm with Def Squad. We rock the house, bring it down. I, yo, the wrath, this is done. After the show, this is the run of time when she was uh, going with Corrupt. I don't know if they was married or not. So after the show, you no, know, because I've seen her in Brooklyn too. And sometimes, and I was dealing with, I was seeing, I was, I was trying to, you know, date her, be a boyfriend, girlfriend. And then Wendy Williams on the radio was like celebrity sightings. They seen us coming out of a hotel. And then Eric Sermon was like, yo, they got you, they got, she got you, Keith. Wendy got you. They talk about you and Bobby. I was like, all right, boss, I don't care. It's cool. I'm going to be spotted. But after the show, like, uh, we rock hardcore, went into the hotel, and she gave me hardcore head. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hardcore head. And, I, and then and I was not ate up, but I never fed her. And then she was with Corrupt at that time. So we was coming out of the hotel after she gave me head, sat me in the chair, gave me head. So I was coming out of the hotel, the Le Montreal, and we was coming, the Corrupt was coming, and he was coming. He was coming, and I said he was, she was coming out the hotel, the, the, the elevator, and we was walking and walking. And I said, oh, I see what you trying to do. You trying to pin, it was the East Coast, West Coast going on. And she said, and I said, yo, I see what you trying to do. You trying to pin two rappers against each other. So I spent off and went the other way. And she went right to him. And that was around the time when she was with him. You know what I'm saying? And God bless the dead. I ain't going to say nothing. But at the Apollo DMX. Bomb, boo, de wop, de, de, de boom. <laughs> with her. You know what I'm saying? But with me, yo, your head. Ah, mm, ate the then I was going to Brooklyn and they angry. She's like, not in my, 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 my brother's room, Keith. No, not here. Head, bang, bang, bang. Oh, in the hotel. There was, then they got married. I was like, oh, dude. that's when I knew. Females are no f***ing go. Yo, she's a main artist. Whopping me off. Married to this dude, but I don't know if they was married at that time. You know what I'm saying? It was around that era, and then they had was beefing with the other girl, the Nivea. They corrupt was with at that time. That time, word, yo. Can you imagine your wife, a rapper, wiping off a nigga and then walking? Well, she was trying to use me. It could have been guns popping that night in there. In that lobby, because I used to do the raises with the with the mouth. I had the raises all the time, so they would have had me in somewhere in L.A. locked up, slicing over some kitty cat with her. You know what I'm saying? Foul, wow moment. Word is bond. I kid you not. I kid you not. Whip wop galore. And he was coming, he was loving her. I mean, the way you talking about it, man, I had no idea you and her had this kind of relationship, but I mean, the way you talking about it, she must got a serious hair game, man. Her hair game must be elite. Cause chuck a suck a nickel to a straw. <laughs> <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.